Good afternoon. It's Miss Elder from Flint Hill Elementary School with another math video. The one we're doing today is markers in a box. So, this says it aligns with operations in addition and multiplication. The task, Presley has 18 markers. Her teacher gives her three boxes and asks her to put an equal number of markers in each box. Anthony has 18 markers. His teacher wants him to put three markers in each box until he is out of markers. Okay, before you figure out what the students should do, answer these three simple questions. Okay, what is the happening in these two situations? So what is happening? One is putting a specific number of markers in a specific number of boxes, and the other is putting a specific number of markers in each box until they run out of markers. How are they similar? Mm. Well, there's something that's the same, and how are they different? In these two problems, two students are using the same number of markers to complete their task. They both have 18 markers, but they're doing two different tasks. Um, Presley's teacher gives her three boxes. That's it. Three boxes and she has to fit all the markers in there evenly, equally. Anthony's teacher gives him 18 markers and says, you're going to put three in each box. She doesn't tell him how many boxes. So what he needs to find out is how many boxes he's going to use. Now, once you use your manipulatives and figure out the answer to both of these, email me at elder.catherine at newton.k12.ga.us and tell me what you learned about division. There are two ways to do division. Okay, thank you. Have a wonderful day. And don't forget, Batty About Books, tonight, Tuesday, November the 10th, 6 p.m.